This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe, and let's get right into the news. Well, D-Thing is home, okay? And, you know, you know, K-Flock is punching the air right now. He's, he's tight, okay? Now, D-Thing, it's amazing that he's home, okay? And I'm going to tell you something. Rumor is he's a hot boy out here. Pause, okay? Pause, my love. My love. <laughs> That's their slang. That's their thing. They they call each other my love. Okay, so he's hot out here. Uh, they're watching him. The feds are watching him, bro. He was indicted with a bunch of people, bro. There was no way this guy was getting out, right? These guys were like murdering pigeons and everything in the River Park Towers. They were they were streaming all their crimes. And immediately when I got out, French Montana, who had done a song with him in the past, ran to sign him with a baby chain, okay? But that chain quickly got replaced by a gumbo chain by Luca Braze, okay? Luca Braze is pushing that gumbo brand. And let's listen to the audio from that, okay? So Luca Braze comes in and he, he takes a a light shot at French Montana. I'm not gonna like play the actual video because he's there's too much activity going on and it, it it won't it won't get monetized. But um basically he says that's a cute chain you got on there. Talking about the Coke Boys chain, and he gives him a huge chain, which you can see in the in the uh slideshow above. <laughs> You heard him say, that's cute, man. That's cute. <laughs> Talk about that little baby Coke, ba Coke boys chain. First of all, Coke boys being out from a fresh indictment is uh is, is suspect in itself but he whips out a big gumbo chain and then also gives him like a bunch of money and signs him to gumbo Tennis 180, the piece 200. So basically, he's, he's claiming it's a $400,000 chain. Look at, look at Braze's known for being... Um, he stretches the truth. I won't call him a liar, okay? But uh, he says the tennis... What is he? Tennis 180. And then uh, 200 for the... I mean, you'd have to be guaranteed this guy isn't going back to jail and you're going to make that money back, Okay. People don't just hand out things like that, okay? They ain't even made money together yet. But he signs with gumbo. Let's listen. This one pristine, by the way. Look, look. Pristine, pristine jewelers. Y'all was gonna get the pristine uh -huh. way. The biggest. Uh -huh. yeah. Yeah, you gotta take that off. No disrespect. No. And then he starts saying like, no disrespect. You gotta take that Coke Boys chain off. <laughs> Respectfully. Respect. You don't even want this bumping up against that. Mm. You can do whatever you want to do with it later. Big Falus is Patty coming out tomorrow. I just got 52. No. That's a half a man. Count it up. No. Oh, that's who he signed to. <laughs> Luca Brazi. That's who he signed to. Right. Yeah. All right. Going the biggest. Right. Now we start recording. Yeah. Now we they veto. They call me Brazy Blue Cheese, no Capitron. You know? Listen, this ain't when the camera go off, I gotta give it back. So good luck my heart. Welcome back. Good luck my heart. See, that's her lingo, the my heart. But anyways, if it's real, it's real. I'm sure Luke Abrazzi gave him that chain, okay? It's a weird situation. 
All right, who's he signed to now? He took off the French Montana little chain, put on the gumbo big chain. But I'm going to tell you something. I wouldn't want my logo around this guy. He's hot out here. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's, it's always nice that your friend comes home. But this guy was on a huge indictment for conspiracy, for murder. Bro, they even got, they got him on like, animal cruelty for killing a pigeon on you know it's like it's crazy it's crazy let's see indictment let's read this 23 gang members attempt murder and animal cruelty how do you get out on that the only thing i can think of is they let him go hopefully and, and they're going to track him watch him and see if he does anything dumb maybe get some other people involved i'm not saying he's working with them i'm just saying all you got to do is let the bait out right he'll get comfortable it might take a few months they do crazy stuff like this man let him out let him get comfortable again see who he's messing with and get more people think about it French Montana gave him cash, right? If he goes and does something illegal with the cash, hypothetically, French Montana is tied to it. Don't forget what 50 Cent said. He said, everything I do is by the book, um, pay stubs and everything, right? If you give someone cash and they take the cash somewhere else, now you can follow the cash, right? Bro, the police are like really good at doing stuff like this you know i would be careful of someone that just came out facing life bro it just doesn't make sense it doesn't make sense but it's not the feds it's nypd but what if the feds picked it up right because it says the nypd arrested them i don't see a federal indictment Is it federal? Let me see. D thing. Federal. Anything others indicted. Yeah, I don't see in the feds. Department of Justice. Let's see. Five alleged street gang members charged with federal racketeering offense. Murder of a Chicago rapper. This is somebody else, I think. C murder. And these drill rappers, C Thang. Yeah, it's a different move. On. That that's for the Chicago thing. Okay, so that's old. Yeah, D Thang is not. I don't see a federal indictment under him, unless I'm wrong. I think it's just the cops. He's he is indicted on racketeering conspiracy though. C Blue, Chef G. Yeah. But he's out. Anyways, man. We'll see what happens. I think he's too... Most people don't touch people when they come home for a little minute. You know, because it's, it's too hot out here. But we'll see. Oh, here it is. Like, court calendar. Bronx District Attorney's Office. D thing. January 2024. What's his name, though? 32 appearances. Wait a minute. Let me see some D thing. Real name. Let me see if he's on this calendar. Daniel Collins. Let's see if he's on here. Is he on the docket? No. All right. We'll see what happens, man. Maybe somehow he beat it. I don't know. You know? I'm a little... It's just it's a little confusing. Anyways, this is Jordan Tao with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. I'll check you guys in the next one. Peace.